hello friends welcome to engineering tutorial now in my previous video uh, we discussed about uh, the conversion of a decimal number into its equivalent octal form okay we discussed how we can convert a base 10 number into base 8 or octal form here we will discuss the opposite how to convert a given octal number into its decimal equivalent form or a base 8 number into a base 10 form. So, before that we must uh, have a quick uh, recap about the weight system in octal numbers. Okay. So, let us take uh, an octal number let us say <coughs> 5, 4 and 7. We can say this is an octal number because all the digits they are less than 8 because only uh, 0 to 7 is allowed in octal number system. Now, here this is the octal point here it is 0 so that does not matter. So, this 7 the, the, according to its position it has a weight value 8 to the power 0. Okay, 8 is the base or radix. Okay, so, this 7 it has a weight value associated with it which is 8 to the power 0. This 4 it has a weight value of 8 to the power 1 and this 5 it has a weight value 8 to the power 2. Okay, so, in order to convert the given octal number okay, 5, 4, 7 octal number we have to convert it into decimal form. So, in order to do that what we will do is that we will multiply the respective digits at the given positions with their weight values that is 5 into 8 to the power 2 plus 4 into 8 to the power 1 plus 7 into 8 to the power 0. So, this is equal to 5 into 64 plus 4 into 8 plus 7 into 1. This is equal to 320. This is 320 plus 32 plus 7, which is equal to 352 plus 7, 350. 359. This is the equivalent decimal number 3, 5, and 9. 547 in base 8 form is equivalent to 359 in decimal form. Now, let us take uh, another number. Okay. Another octal number and we will convert it into decimal form using the same technique. Let us say 760 this is the octal number and we have to convert it into the decimal form. 760 it is an octal number we can say because all the digits they are all the symbols they are less than 8 they are allowed in the octal system. So, the same thing we will do 7 into this has a weight value of 8 to the power 2 this is 8 to the power 0 8 to the power 1 and this is 8 to the power 2 plus 6 into 8 to the power 1 plus 0 into 8 to the power 0 it does not matter so this is 7 into 64 plus 6 into 8 plus 0. This is equal to uh, 7 for 28, 448 and this is equal to 48 plus 0. So, this is equal to 496 in decimal form. So, what we have done is that we have simply multiplied the weight values with the 
given digits according to their positions okay the weight values associated with it okay so this zero it has a weight value of 8 to the power 0 so you multiply it with zero but doesn't matter because anything multiplied with zero is zero this six it has a weight value of 8 to the power 1 so it multiplied it with 8 to the power 1 this seven it has a weight value of 8 to the power 2 so you multiplied it with 8 to the power 2 which is 64 and we just added the values and we got the result Next, let us see how we can convert a fractional octal number into uh, its equivalent decimal form. Okay, so before that, let us take a, a fractional octal number, let us say uh, 0 0.346. It is an octal number, all the symbols are within, uh, within 0 and 7 and we have to convert it into the given uh, decimal form, let us say. Now, let us just write this fractional octal number. This is the octal point, okay, octal point. Now, we know that everything to the right of the octal point, it has negative powers starting from 1. The base remains the same whatever the base of the system is. So, this will have a weight value of 8 to the power minus 1, this 3. This 4, it will have a weight value of 8 to the power minus 2 and this 6, it will have a weight value of 8 to the power minus 3. So, in order to convert it into the decimal equivalent, what we will do? will multiply it with the respective weight values 3 into 8 to the power minus 1 plus 4 into 8 to the power minus 2 so what we'll do is that 3 into 8 to the power minus 1 plus 4 into 8 to the power minus 2 plus 6 into 8 to the power minus 3 which is equal to 3 into 1 by 8 plus 4 into 1 by 64 plus 6 by uh, 8 to the power 3 which is equal to say 64 512 I think 64 into 8 yes 512 yes Okay, so this will be around uh, 0 0.375, 0 0.375, let me calculate to be sure, 0 0.375 plus 0 0.063 and this is plus uh, 0.3. 0, 0, 001 so the net result will be around 0 0.439 0 0.439 okay this will be so 0 0.346 in octal form will be 0 0.439 in decimal form okay so we have done nothing, just we have multiplied the respective digits according to their positions with the weight values. And the weight values to the right of the octal point starts with negative powers starting from 1. or So, it is 8 to the power minus 1 associated with 3, 8 to the power minus 2 associated with 4 and 8 to the power minus 3 associated with 6. Okay. So, here we have discussed how to convert a given octal number into its equivalent decimal form. So, how to convert both whole octal numbers and octal numbers with fractional parts. So, I hope you like this video and uh, please subscribe my channel Engineering Tutorial for more such videos related to electrical, electronics, instrumentation and communication engineering. Have a great day. Thank you very much.